Okay. <sighs> Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Quazy. Uh, and today a catch up session is due. First of all, Happy New Year. Woo! Happy 2022. I am so happy to be here. I've even written everything down so that I don't forget anything. And yeah, let's rock and roll. So I'm getting ready for dinner actually. Um, so I've got some makeup to do. Basically how I've been doing my face these days. Um, I don't know hey. I had expected my makeup to get more complicated with time. Um, but the reality is that I don't have the time for a long um makeup routine and on top of that i never have the space for all of my makeup especially because i'm always traveling right now i'm in cape town uh let me just pull my hair back a bit so that i can get started there's just not all the space in the world for me to have a ton of makeup uh, so this bag has come in handy big time these days this is what i use to carry all my makeup around I literally have to stuff everything in here and if it can't get in here, that's it. Um, one big win for 2021 was that I finally stopped breaking out. Um, I changed my diet in like April last year and I became gluten free, dairy free and whew, that was so needed. Thank God. Ever since I've changed to gluten free, dairy free uh no pimples no new pimples no insane like scars or anything so i'm so grateful for that um so yeah 2022 is going to be about like healing all the scars that have maybe stayed behind um and just really really looking after my natural skin so to wash my face most days if i'm not wearing makeup i'll just use the royal boss um gentle cleansing bar uh obviously it's in the bathroom and it's just a soggy bath so i'll just put a picture somewhere yeah and it's really cheap actually but it works like a charm um and it's so gentle so yeah that's perfect for me most days not every day is like that some days i am wearing a lot of makeup and i find that with makeup removal i'm wearing a ton of makeup and i find that after the first removal there's still makeup left behind um i found that a lot with removing my makeup with wipes so i've moved to uh removing my makeup with this gentle magic mask um so this is a the gentle magic skincare mask um it's actually an exfoliating facial cleanser but i find that if i just put water on top of all my makeup and i rub this on top that everything comes off properly like in one go uh, which is a huge deal because I mean even with wipes if you're rubbing and rubbing and rubbing and rubbing and rubbing um, And stuff is not coming off and you're cleansing once twice three times Then that's just really abrasive So it's important to get makeup removal done in one go and this gets the job done uh, today moisturizer after uh, Cleansing with the rooibos bar. Um, I used this Clinique um uh, hydrating jelly this has been the perfect lightweight moisturizer um, for oily skin like mine um, it's been a dream I love Clinique as a brand um, but I must say that this moisturizer as light as it is girl go girl give us nothing like she brings nothing to the table um in terms of like nutrients like my skin you need a serum under this like for sure and you need to be doing something completely different at night like a hydrating mask a brightening mask and all of that because like this one she gives the bare minimum um but we love her anyways she has no spf she literally she is nothing okay but she's great and she's expensive so we use her so i'm just gonna get straight into my powder oh okay so um i bought the wrong color powder first of all like i know it's excuses all the time you're tired of me so i accidentally bought uh nc45 
um instead of nc50 i think i was in such a hurry when i was at mac i had a friend's wedding coming up and i just wanted to be in there and out of there and i got the wrong color um and then on top of that i know i say this in every single video but yesterday i was at the promenade and the sun burns my skin okay so this color is not gonna match properly um so yeah i'm glad we got that out of the way but i mean i love new powders can you just look at how pretty this is inside i love that it's new it's so so nice like it's everything um yeah and when you open it up you know the fact that the sponge still has white on it is huge so i don't really do foundations that much anymore um and i don't do bb cream that much anymore either because i really want a full coverage look and i find with foundation it's just so much work to get the application right whereas with powder i just do whatever and i put fixing spray on at the end and it evens everything out for me let's get started on this application so i'm just going to take the sponge that comes with this i'm going to pack on as much product as i can i've got a mirror right here um and i'm just going to cover like every inch that i can uh because i've got airpods on i'm gonna have to do my ears after this video um so let's not worry too much about that um let's get under the eye as well okay so the first layer of powder has gone right on i know i look like a scary ghost right now but it's gonna get better no worries um so in my bag of goodies um i have some blush i can see that i didn't bring any eyeshadow on this trip um and it happens all the time that i forget some eyeshadow so what i'm gonna do is that i'm just gonna take um this lovely blush brush i'll link it down below if you're interested in getting it i've got this um blush and highlight palette i'll link it down below um and yeah this has been abused big time you can tell i'm all about the blush in there um but yeah this this palette really has never ever let me down and i love it i guess that's my eye color done for now uh, next we should probably just do some cheeks um, and then let me just dig in there I love that this a uh, brush just covers the highlights as well so I've got blush and highlights all at once and with one sweep on my cheeks I can just apply it at the same time brows um, I still use my trusted eye kit it's insane there's like nothing left uh, there's like zero eyebrow pomade left. I don't know if you can see that. It is empty over here. Literally empty. Okay, so eyebrows done. Nice, quick and easy. Um, so next I'm going to do some eyeliner. Okay, winged eyeliner done. Nice and easy as well. Like makeup has become so easy for me. Like it's a breeze. I'm in, I'm out. Um, and I'm so happy. I guess that's just what comes with um, practice um, and patience. So yeah, I'm so happy that I'm at this place with my makeup. Uh, next up, I'm going to probably stick on some eyelashes. Um, so in this lovely bag of mine, um, I've got some lashes by Huda Beauty. Um, I have cut them up a bit, but this is Huda Beauty. And these are amazing absolutely amazing um i got them like at a china mall so i can't say like 1000 percent that it's huda beauty um but yeah i don't see huda beauty being like distributed like that in a clicks or anything so if this is really huda beauty it's amazing i also have the huda beauty waterproof lash glue which is absolutely amazing as well so anytime i see the name huda beauty i'm jumping on it because it's gonna be literally the best thing both ever. lashes are on but i'm just gonna go into the corner of my eyes with some eyeliner just to make like a continuation of you know the strong black line this is uh my mac um brush black brush stroke 24 hour liner um i'll link it down below okay so next um i'm going to line my lips um i'm going to use the um mac plum lip pencil um it's a lovely dark color i absolutely adore this color 
um so yeah i'm gonna go in with it my lips are lined which is great um so i'm gonna go in with um my very unfortunate little baby this is the best lipstick i have ever had um and i've been holding on to it for dear life uh, as you can see this mac, mac little bag is coming in handy because this little guy has absolutely fallen apart i don't know if you can see um but yeah the lid broke some way somehow then one day i was doing my lipstick and the stick fell into a friend's ashtray okay so i'm literally just putting anything on my lips right now but it's just because i love this color so much um so this is max feel so grand lip paint it is a strong bright red it is the best red i've ever seen since ruby woo okay um so yeah here goes all right so lipstick is done nice clean lines and yeah this is the final parts where i know i look like a ghost right now but all of that is about to change so mac fixing spray hey i bought another mini one this stuff is so so good from fixing all cakey makeup um and just turning it into an even finish a dewy look a natural look it just sets everything so well like it's unreal so let me show you what i'm talking about okay it's on now so let me just wait for it to go in guys thanks for indulging me and just look at how perfectly dewy this makeup has turned out to be i mean <laughs> all right you guys have a lovely day um exciting developments in the youtube world um first of all i am so 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 excited to announce that i officially have 100 subscribers and counting um it is such an amazing moment for me to have 100 subscribers like i can't believe it i remember when i struggled just to get to 10 subscribers um numbers have picked up i've even got people that i don't know on there and i think it's mainly because of youtube shorts um so yeah i guess that's something new that i'll be doing uh, in the year 2022 definitely more investing videos uh just uh right now i'm just putting together the capital for the investing on a larger scale um so it's gonna be crypto and other things also a few more shopping hauls definitely still importing more clothes uh then trying them on of course definitely buying more makeup if anything i'd be buying more lip colors i'm still on the hunt for the perfect eye color definitely looking for an eyeshadow with a whole lot of pigment um and i hope that i'm able to find it my 2022 resolutions um i i don't really have that many i think i'm still thinking about it honestly i was still just celebrating getting into the new year for me fitness is definitely still a huge theme for this year uh this year i want to focus on flexibility i'm working on doing the splits i would love to film a video um on that journey i definitely will um and then in terms of um the law of attraction uh, i really want to speak more positively about others i learned how to stop complaining about the world around me and all those things um but i didn't quite learn how to stop complaining about the people around me um so that's definitely my focus this year is to focus on people's positive traits because everyone has them everyone has a good sign um a good side to them and i know that focusing on people's positive traits is definitely going to make them just multiply and i'm going to have the most amazing people 
around me um but yeah you guys thank you so much for the love and for the support and i'm so excited for this year um and all the videos that i'm going to be making <laughs>